Hi guys, today I want to share you a tips about uh, quick view form. So first of all, let me introduce the uh, requirement background. So we have a field named applicant. So uh, I want sh I want to show the detailed uh, contact information of this field of this uh, applicant. So let's look at. Okay, if I ch you know. This uh, this field applicant could be a, it's a customer type. It's out of box field. It could be an account or a, a contact. So we, okay, you can see that I can choose the organization. It's a contact, right? And also I can choose a contact. If I choose a, a, a account, so it will show uh, the uh, detailed information of the primary contact if i choose a contact so it will just show uh the uh, uh contact information of this contact uh directly so okay let me show you how to do that let's look at the form so you can see this is a field this field is uh, customer id uh you can see it's uh out of box uh, field, it's a customer ID, it's a customer type, so it could be an account or a contact. So I just add two. Uh, I just added two uh, quick view form, so you can see you can you can just uh, 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 click here, uh, hit this button, uh, go to the uh, insert tab, uh, go uh, just. Uh, Hit this, uh, click this uh, quick view form. Just insert quick view form here. So here I have two quick view forms. So one is for uh, the contact. So if the applicant is contact is choose uh, con choose uh, a contact, so it will show here. So but if if the contact uh, uh, applicant is um, account, so. I just pop. I will populate. I would. I just use JavaScript to populate this primary contact field. Then I will use this quick view form to show uh, the details of this primary contact. And so, at the, uh, you know, if the applicant is a contact, so uh, uh, here uh, this quick view form will. No, we're not showing and, and will show nothing, so uh, it will be hide automatically. Yeah, so yeah, for this quick view form, if there's no data to show, so it will be 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 uh, uh be hide. So if there's some data to show, it will be uh, it will show. Yeah. Okay. Um. So. Yeah, that's it. Uh, just that you know. Uh, so this quick view form. And uh, okay, let's double uh, click. Uh, show you the uh, details of this uh, quick view form. The quick view form we need to specify uh, the, uh, the this field, right? Applicant field, and we need to specify uh, the re re related entity, its contact. So when Applicant is contact, so I will show the contact info here, and I I need to specify the uh, quick view form, so you can create a form, uh, for just for this quick view form, yeah. Okay, then then let's look at this one. This one is show the details of this field, primary contact field. So I just specify the lookup field is primary contact, right? This field. And uh, it's, it's also contact entity and use the same form. Yes. And normally I will hide this field because, you know, the user doesn't need to know this field. They just specify this applicant, right? If the applicant is account, so I will uh, Populate this this uh, primary contact automatically, but it will be hidden. Hey, uh, be behaved uh, for the user. Yeah, I just show uh, 
the primary contact information here. Yeah, that's it. Uh, hopefully it could be, uh, it, it can, um, yeah, be helpful for you. Okay, thank you.